Guten Tag, food fans, and welcome to a very special edition of Cooking with Gunther. I am Gunther. Let's cook. Now, today on Cooking with Gunther, we're not actually going to be doing any cooking. Instead, I want to show you what I just got in the mail. I am very excited about it. It was very expensive. In front of me, you will see a very special package from Heatonist. It is a, a shop that sells uh, nothing but hot sauce from Brooklyn, Bro Bro New York. In, in the New York City. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to open this for you. It's like an unboxing and show you the three sauces I bought that cost me $40. So in the box we have, uh, let's see, oh, a little note saying, uh, thanks for ordering. Taylor, who is Taylor? I think they meant Gunther. They're very confused. Um, so it tells me what sauces that I ordered. Some Homeboys Hot Funds hot sauce, uh, some Secret Advac Habanero hot sauce, and some ad adob Adobo Loco hot sauce. So we have a sticker from Heat Nest, uh, my secret Aardvark sauce, the Hot Fun sauce, and uh, the Adobo Loco, which is smoked ghost pepper, which I'm very excited about and I'm very afraid of. So these are very expensive sauces. This was uh, $8, this was $12, and this was $14. That is so much, but uh, they're supposed to be very good. I'm very looking forward to this one. So I have each of the sauces, the Aardvark, the Hot Funs, and the ghost pepper, and you are going to watch as I try each one of them and give you my review of them. All right, so first up we have the, uh, the Secret Art Bark. Hmm. Hmm. Okay. So I've been sitting with this for about 30 seconds, and not a lot of heat, not very much heat, um, in my opinion, but lots of, lots of good flavor. Tomatoes, um, it'd be a good salsa just directly on chips. It would, it would be good. So next we have the Hot One Sauce, and I'm very excited because it's my favorite show on YouTube, but um, we're going to try it and we'll see how it is. Not very much heat, it's pretty okay. Um, you know, it's it's good. I like it. I like it. Again, not, not the hottest sauce, not very hot at all. My lips have a nice warm tingle, but uh, nothing hurting or anything. But it's nice flavor, nice and fruity. It could be good on chicken. So now we try the smoked ghost pepper, and I don't have a ton on there, but um, I don't want to die, so let's see what happens. So after about 30 seconds, obviously, honestly, not much. Um, a little bit of heat, but it's nice, it's tolerable. It's the kind of heat I like. Um, good flavor, great smoke. So I'm starting to feel it more on my lips. My lips burn a little bit, but my mouth is, is fine. Um, I'm not worried about it at all. I wonder what the Scoville is on that. I can watch the video, they did that. So there we are, new, uh, three new hot sauces tried. Um, good amount of heat, not a, not a ton, but I'm excited to put some in some ramen and eat that and try that today. Well, once again, food fans, danke schön for joining me today. And um, my name is Gunther. This has been Cooking with Gunther. Godspeed and good day.